Hello my dear family members, if you are preparing for Ascenture and if you have technical exam within very few days then this video is for you. As all of you know guys there will be total 45 MCQ questions, technical MCQ questions out of those 10 to 12 MCQ from MS office and its common application and then uh, there will be total 10 to 11 pseudocode questions and cloud and networking questions then computer science based IT fundamentals questions okay so now these 10 to 12 MS office questions will be very much important because sectional cutoff it also matters okay sectional cutoff also matters so out of let's say total 45 MCQ if they set the cutoff at 60 percent then uh, overall 60 percent is good okay but sometimes let's say there is a lesser requirement then they initiate the sectional cutoff so that's why it matters also so give importance to the ms office questions as well now let me share the latest ms office questions which can be repeated and which type of questions can be repeated in your exam as well so let me just share all of these just before that guys if you have not subscribed this channel yet then please subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding any company that i want and let me know which content you want more by commenting that company name if it is capgemini infosys or take mahindra or tcs just comment down i'll make more content on those okay so now let me share the image of questions Hey, you ready for the future tech? No UF is here with premium prep materials. No need to fear. Cognizant Accenture TCS and more. We'll get you ready. Open up that door. Which feature in MS Word allows you to automatically format certain text as you type? Find and replace autocorrect mail merge or track changes. So actually regarding the mail merge, there will be one questions, I guess, because most of the time I see the questions are from mail merging. So this is very important topic. Okay. So uh, in this case, what will be the correct answer? Please give the answer in the comment section before I give. Okay. So let me share the answer. So correct answer will be auto correct. Okay. So next question is this in Excel. What does the function sum a1 is to a5 do? Subtract values from sales a1 to a5 multiplies, adds, or divides. So as the name suggests, sum to so this adds the values. Okay, so option C will be the correct answer. Okay, so let's go to the next question. That is this uh, option. Uh, sorry, question number three. Which MS PowerPoint view allows you to see multiple slides at once and rearranging them? Slide sorter view, normal view, slide show view, notes page view. So, what is the correct answer? Actually, guys, you have to do basic like uh, you have to check the basic functionalities. What is the object? What are the objects or uh, objectives of? certain uh, features or any buttons these are the questions you will be asked okay and from excel you will be asked one to two uh what uh, one to two formula based question and there will be more questions from excel but this can be related to table okay so and uh, in powerpoint uh, you have to focus on the features focus on the some uh, like objectives of buttons etc etc okay so which ms powerpoint view allows you to see multiple slides at once and rearranging them slide sorter views normal view and slide show view and notes page view so for this correct answer will be slide sorter view okay before i go to the next question i want you to have the best prime materials for ascent chart in which you will get all the latest questions from cognitive assessment technical assessment and communication assessment interview experience all the things from gaming round you can play the game at real time and also updated up to today this is updated up to today and also you'll get all the latest interview experience and communication assessment live videos are available there as well you can see the feedback of students provided below so please go through that it will be very much helpful thousands more than 2000 students have go, uh, gone through this and they could clear this round okay so please go through that the link will be provided in the description box or in the comment section thank you so now let me discuss the question so let's go to the next question that is what is the primary purpose of the of using outlook creating speed sheets sending and receiving emails editing images or programming so this is very easy question sending and receiving emails so this is very easy but still 
from the outlook you can have some questions okay so just uh, like remind it okay so next question is which keyword shortcut is used to open new document in ms word control n control s control p control o so actually this will be a quiz question for you so please pause the video and try to keep the answer in the comment section okay so guys one thing if you have not subscribed then please subscribe this because this motivates me to make more content okay so i hope you will give the answer in the comment section and let me share one experience that is in these days if you are uh you are you are giving exam at home then most probably two coding questions will be repeated and let's say if you are giving the quest exam from the institute then you will be asked the first coding questions almost similar as the 16th august question or the second question will be almost similar as 16th august but little bit manipulated question okay not fully same the second question second coding question will be almost same but not fully same they will manipulate the question little bit okay so i hope i will understand so let's go to the next question that is in excel which shortcut key is used to insert the current date in a cell control d control plus uh, semicolon control plus shift plus is two or shift control plus d which will be the correct answer so uh, to insert the current date in a cell you have to use control plus semicolon okay so control b will be the sorry control uh, semicolon will be the correct answer next question is uh, which shortcut key used to open a new tab in most web browsers control t control n control w or control h uh, to open a new tab so control t will be the correct answer okay okay so let me go to the next question that is what does the uh, what does pressing control plus w do in most web browsers so i am not reading the options actually it closes the current tab okay so let's go to the next question that is which ms word feature is used to combine data from excel with a word documenting for printing multiple forms mail merge cross reference hyperlink or bookmark so uh, question number nine so what will be the correct answer that is mail merge okay multiple forms okay for printing multiple forms we can use mail merge this will reduce the time okay so let's go to the next question that is uh, question number 10 in ms powerpoint which feature allows you to create a similar design across multiple slides slide master smart art word art slide sorter so question number 10 so this will be a quick question for you so every five questions will be a quick question for you so please pause the video and try to give the answer in the comment section and again i will request you to have the prime materials of accenture in which i have included all the prime all the recent questions with answers like coding questions technical questions and mock test as well so if you want then please damn me at my study or you can just pay 79 rupees using the upi id given in the description box and send me the screenshot at our email id or at our instagram id okay so i will send it okay so let's go to the next question that is which is the correct shortcut to send an email in outlook uh control plus enter control plus c plus s alt plus enter and c plus f9 so in this case the correct answer will be control plus enter okay if you have not used outlook yet then you can do it by yourself and check okay so let's go to the next question that is which of the following is a browser commonly used for web browsing so this could not be a question okay so uh, ignore it okay so actually this should not be a question okay so let's go to the next question that is which key combination is used to paste the copied content in most application control v control c control p control x so actually uh correct answer will be i will not give the answer please give the answer in the comment section okay still uh, you can see this is very easy question but still they have asked this type of question that's why i have included it okay so let's go to the next question that is this will be a quiz question huh? please give the answer so in excel which shortcut key is used to create a new worksheet to create new worksheet uh control shift n alt f 11 control f 11 shift f 11 so shift f 11 will be the correct answer so the next question is which of the following is used to access the find and replace uh control f control h control g and control r so control h will be the correct answer okay access the find and replace so let me go to actually control f to find okay and control h for 
of find and replace okay so next question is what is the function of control z in uh, control z shortcut key so actually this is used to undo the last action and control plus y for redo the last action okay so let's go to the next question that is in ms excel which key combination allows you to quickly insert a new row quickly insert a new row in ms excel which will be the correct answer control shift plus plus okay so the next question is what is the shortcut to create a new email messages in ms outlook so this is uh, like control n control m control shift n control shift m which will be the correct answer control n n okay the next question is which ms word view displays a document as it will appear when printed print layout yeah this will be the correct answer print layout so i hope you guys having little bit understanding about these uh, like a common application of ms office so if, if you want the details uh, answer details explanation then please uh, comment down that if you you, you want uh, detailed explanation okay and guys if you want any other companies content any other companies materials then damn me at my study okay like uh, we have Accenture, tcs cognizant capgemini tech mahindra zoho delta x infosys etc etc companies materials so if you want then you can grab it okay so the next question and the last question of today's session is what is the default file extension for ms excel workbooks dot xls dot docx dot xlsx dot pptx this is like multiple time asked so please give the answer okay so let me share it dot xls uh, xlsx will be the correct answer okay so guys i hope this much of information is also helpful so if you found this video helpful then please subscribe this channel and watch this regarding any company that i want and if you want any other companies content and materials then please suggest me or damn me at my study okay so i hope you guys will do so so thank you for today's session please subscribe to techno uf and don't forget to like and share with your friends